John 21, 20. Peter turned and saw the disciple whom Jesus loved was following them. That was the one who leaned back against Jesus at the supper and said, Lord, who is going to betray you? We know it's written by John because John doesn't want to talk to himself about himself. When Peter saw him, he said, Lord, what about him? Lord, what about that guy? If, if, if I'm going to get beat up, is he going to get beat up too? Sounds like two brothers, doesn't it? Sounds like a little kid. Jesus answered, he said, if I want him to remain alive until I return, what is that to you? You must follow me. Jesus looked at Peter, said, Peter, listen. The gifts I've given them, him, and my calling in his life is between me and him. The question for today is not John. The question for today is you. One of the phrases I learned young in life, I need to focus on me rather than the, not the with a capital T-H-E-E. Whether I'm great or small, I need to focus on me rather than thee, rather than anybody else. You see, I have a personal relationship with God and I'm responsible to God for the way I act. I'm not responsible for the way you act. Just me. And my job is not to fix you. I have enough problems fixing me. In this woke culture, I hear people say, well, it's not fair that they've got so much. You know what? I am proud for Warren Buffett. Obviously, he can handle his money. Obviously, I drive a 22-year-old pickup truck with 202,000 miles, and I am proud to have it. It's mine.